Hello guys, this is Jagan from Capital Zone. Few people were asking, Jagan, um, I had seen your uh, screenshot, you use both Python and uh, Ami Broker. So which is best? Which should I use? And why? So if I am new, which one I can use? Can I use both? So if you have uh, these many questions and this video will definitely will help you out. So which is best for trading? So there are uh, multiple uh, ways to look. Which is best for ch uh, charting and uh, best for coding and debugging, backtesting, algo trading. There are many uh, aspects, right? So with, with respect to different aspect, actually we are trying to see actually what is best. Okay. For some aspect, actually Ambi Broker may be best and some aspect, actually the Python may be best. Right. For charting. Charting, clearly Ami Broker leads over Python because Ami Broker is having excellent UI. It, gets, it has all indicators. Okay, so you take RSA, MACD, everything. Okay, you don't need to write any code. You can just drag and drop and then it works like a charm and you can customize any parameter and the UI is super duper. But with the Python, actually, it is really tough. Uh, you need to write your own code. Though the TA library, technical analysis library is available with the Python, um, you need to write the code. But here, actually, you, uh, you don't need to write any code. You can just drag and drop the indicator. It works like a charm. Okay, so... So charting wise, Ami Broker is always best. I always use Ami Broker for my trend following system. Okay. And coding and debugging. Okay. Coding and debugging. So some people will say actually Ami Broker is best. Uh, but in my opinion, actually Python is best. Because if you are not known to Python and Ami Broker, Python is very simple language. But Ami Broker is vector based language. So for newcomer, the, this vector based language is always really tough. And uh, because it executes everything like an array, like a vector. So it's really hard. In, in real term, vector based language is very rare. Okay. If you take C in C++, Java, they are not vector based language. Okay. So Python is uh, idiomic, uh, idiomic language. It's like uh, English. So if this is equal, if this is not, if this is empty. So likewise, actually you can write a code uh, in Python. It is very simple. So it has multiple usage of uh, 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 semantics so very simple language than Ami Broker in my opinion if some somebody is new to uh, both Ami Broker and Python Python is better actually okay so Python is a very simple language so it is a open source Python is a open source it is a free of course so you will get a lot of help and lot of free resources available for Python so say for example you want to do some data processing in Ami Broker it's very very difficult to get a help because there are only limited number of people are working in Ami Broker, but a lot of lot of people are working in Python. So Python it is easy to get a help, and Ami Broker is not an open source; it is a paid one. And debugging is dead easy with the Python, and Ami Broker is a bit hard. It's possible. I'm not saying it is not possible, but Ami Broker it is not user friendly when it comes to debugging. Okay, but with the Python there are n number of debugger available wherein you can easily debug any uh, problems. So when it comes to coding and debugging, I would say actually Python is best. Okay. So the next one is in what aspect actually let's see that backtesting. Okay. So backtesting there are two things. Number one for directional, you have a price action for future or cash market. You use moving average MACD or OHLC or price action. Ami Broker is best okay, because it has a good framework for backtesting. You don't need to develop any framework. You just need to give the buy and sell. It gives all the details and it is faster than Python. It is much, much faster than Python. Very, very easy to backtest any indicators. You don't need to write any indicators code. By default, it does everything and framework is there. You just need to give the parameter. You can mention actually, do you want to uh, trade for five minutes? Uh, do you want to trade only for a specific time? And what is the sharp ratio? What is the drawdown? What is the R ratio? Everything it does. So this one has all the details. Okay. But what is the problem uh, uh, for Ami Broker when it comes to the option strategies? So combined leg strategies, it is very tough to do it in Ami Broker. Whereas with the Python, Python does not have any specific library, but many people have written and then that library can make use of it. As I said, Python is a open source. So many people will write the code and then uh, will help the uh, open community. 
So in such a cases, actually Python is backtesting. Also, there is a library available for technical analysis. Also, the library is available. Option strategies also the library is available. It is not part of Python, but somebody has somebody had written the code and then posted in open source. So you can make use of it for option strategies. Python is best. I use option strategies. I use Python for option strategies. For my trend following, I use uh, Ami Broker. That you know, I do the trend following Nifty. So for that one, actually, I use Ami Broker. All right. So the next one is in what aspect? Algo trading. Okay. For algo trading, Python is much, much better than Ami Broker because most broker will give the api in python they will not give the api in ami broker but it does not mean that you can't do the uh, algo trading in uh, ami broker it's possible because there are uh, ami broker bridges available through ami broker also you can trade but it is really complicated it is python is best when it comes to algo trading and most broker will give the python sdk as i said so you can write your code in any language like C, Java, but most broker will give the Python SDK because Python is most commonly used language. Okay, so that's it. And machine learning and deep learning is possible only with the Python. It is not possible with Ami broker because Ami broker does not have that library. But when it comes to Python, Python have a list of library for machine learning and deep learning and machine learning, deep learning, I will explain in a separate video later uh, whenever I get a time. But right now you can assume that actually artificial intelligence, okay, and then uh, automatic learning is possible only with the Python. It is not possible with any broker at all. If possible, you need to write your own code and still trading through uh, Ami broker is also possible through REST API but you need to write a code and it is going to be really complicated it is going to take time okay so that's what so the next one is speed wise which one is higher will have a higher speed okay so higher speed ami broker leads over python because ami broker is in native language and python is very very lightweight python uh, has a list of libraries heavy libraries python is heavy and it is not a uh, native one so thus ami broker is more lightweight than python so when it comes to the speed ami broker uh, will be faster but nowadays actually everyone is having the super duper system with the highest processor with the super ram so it does not matter whether you use ami broker or python uh, so if you are uh, uh, trading if you are using any system which is in uh, 2000 or 2010 maybe you can make use of ami broker but nowadays the speed does not matter for uh, back testing so that's actually yeah you can use python if you uh, uh, if you want to make use of full features of the library but if you want a very very higher speed for back testing you need to go through ami broker so Ami runs like a native language, like a C, C++, so it is faster and Python runs like a library function, so it is little slower than uh, Ami broker. So the next one is, the cost wise, Ami broker is a licensed one, it is not a free, it is free maybe for a week or one month of time, uh, uh, you need to uh, pay the license cost. but. Python is free and it is open source. Okay, so not only that, Python you can use with any platform. You want to use in Windows, you want to use in Linux, you want to use in Mac, you can use. But Ami Broker is available only with Windows. So, a very important point. So, what I use, I use both simply. For Ami Broker, Ami Broker I use for charting, it's awesome. And back testing my trend following system because this is in futures nifty futures and uh, i use a lot of indicators as well apart from price action so for myself ami broker is space and uh, back testing it takes only one seconds that's it pretty, pretty fast and with respect to the python the back testing of my option strategies say for example short shuttle short strangle everything i use in python and my algo trading is also running in python so i use both okay so, so the now question is jagan i am something new so I don't know Ami Broker, I, I also don't know the Python. So what should I use? In my opinion, actually Python is best because it is growing in exponential speed. 
okay so five years before actually if you say python people will assume that it is a snake <laughs> now if you say actually python is coming like a snake then they will say actually python programming is coming so so nowadays actually the python is becoming very very uh, uh, viral and uh, it is growing in exponential speed with the huge set of libraries you don't need to write any code at all you need to write only two to two three lines even for backtesting even for option strategies even for trading api for everything the help is needed the help is there so thus python is best but still if you want to use ami broker you can use and mainly artificial intelligence and learnings okay so deep learning and machine learning so nowadays actually it's very important to have a deep learning and machine learning to update your uh, algorithm for which python is good and python is free you don't need to pay any cost at all so python is free but whereas ami broker is cost and algo api and trading api uh, trading uh, most broker will give the uh, python uh, api they don't give any ami broker api in fact they don't give even c api also so and the vast help so to to uh, you have some issues in ami broker to resolve this issue to find out the right person it is really uh, difficult to find but if you have some issues with the python with one or two lines uh, with one google you will find the solution so in my opinion actually uh, python is best and um, um, uh, so with that actually i would say actually whichever the uh, language you like you can take uh, but my take is python maybe you can try both and whichever is comfortable uh, for you can try guys uh, now you know actually what is the difference between ami broker and python why i am crazy about python uh, in the workshop also i will be explaining actually how you can get a python sdk and how you can code little uh, little bit about algo trading how you can trade not exact uh, the overall uh, algo trading uh, it is not possible uh, to explain in one workshop in the workshop i will be telling actually if you are coming from the programming programming background okay so you can get the Py python sdk and you can develop your own uh, algorithm so i'll give you a hint uh, on uh, how to develop your own algo uh, software and we have a workshop in uh, chennai bangalore mumbai and delhi and hyderabad if you are interested to learn uh, all my intraday strategies with respect to the python as well then you can subscribe and uh, thanks for watching i'll be back with one more video soon